So uh, I went out yesterday and uh, this is the mask that I used. I tried to retrofit uh, this mask. I think I was pretty successful in using these uh, 3M um, 1900 uh, it's rated particles. Um, and what I basically did, I'll show you how I did it, was um, I doubled over the filter over here and uh, stuck it on with an elastic and then gaffer taped it and then actually stuffed some in here. The only problem I did have was the fact that uh, uh, I started to fog up. So maybe um, I did have too much um, filters on it. So I I'm gonna try to do it a different way and I'll show you how I did it. I uh, purchased two of them. One's a small one and this one's a large one. And uh, I'm going to go through that today, and I'll show you how I've done it. Now, I put this mask in this kind of to make sure that this filter, which is the 3M filter, uh, I don't know which side is right side up. So what I'm going to do is there's still some cardboard from from it i'm gonna basically i'm gonna cut i cut it earlier I believe it was on this side and then i'm gonna double it over and basically right about there um is where I'll make the filter adjustment. Okay, so I made sure I cleaned the surface. I believe I did cut it over here. So I will continue cutting. Try to use as much as I can. And so I basically cut a square piece. It doesn't have to be that much. Um, and then I'll double it over. So possibly. Let's see, thinking like that. But I might do two pieces because I do have another mask. So I'll start from here and do a clear cut. Uh, let's see if I can see that. Clear cut, I'm trying to cut onto the line. Okay, almost cut there. So. Again, I don't know which side is the right side up. Looks like I'll roll this up. I don't need this anymore. And so basically we've got one piece and I'm gonna fit it in there as well as there's another piece over there. So, excuse my phone. I don't need this anymore. I will place it back in the plastic bag and put it in a safe, dark place. Um, possibly I should have put it in cardboard, or um, not cardboard, but a brown paper bag. I don't have one. Now I will, this filaments I, I don't need. I'll cut that off. Filaments I don't need. Bingo. Basically, double it over like that. Actually, and I might use that other piece for the inside. And so it'll go like that. And I'll seal it. So, actually, I changed my mind. I'm going to actually use all of it and nothing in the inside. It is coming off a little bit. Um, so I'll delicately put one there, put one there, put one there, and doubled over. And this will go over here like this. 
Oh, somebody on the roof. it like that and fasten it tightly on the round. I might have to take my gloves off to do this. Uh, sticking it to them. I think now it's safe because if there's any virus on these gloves, the filter will block it. Unfortunately, we'll have to do that. Okay. Kind of snapped. Take the gloves off. See how I do that? I'll dispose of these. I'll be back shortly. Uh, tactical. sure I get a good surface so it will not so I just take this off and that's the second mask now make sure I and these are cheap these were like I got them on eBay for less than 20 about $20. And the filter was 24 and I believe I could probably go maybe 7 8 days of steady use every day. Um, I probably will use this a couple times. This isn't for me. This is for somebody else. Um and so there we have it, two. One's a small one, and uh, one is a larger. So there we go, two. 